What's this? A package. It's the CCS Combo One adapter from Tesla. Let's open it up. Okay, I've never done an unboxing video before. How are we gonna do this? Let's see here. All right, I'm gonna have to put the camera down. Let's see, how do we open this crazy box? Ah, uh, looks like there might be tape. Ah, just like a FedEx envelope. Ah, there we go. And there it is. CCS1 adapter. Plug the CCS charge cable in here. There are the two DC power pins. And there's the Tesla. And then when you plug it into your car, this pin goes in and locks the charger to this adapter. Pretty neat. Not much to it. I'll put it back in the box and let's go try it out. I've got uh, the Electrify America station plugged into the NAV. It's way up here in Northeast Charlotte at a Walmart. There aren't that many Electrify America stations in North Carolina, maybe half a dozen. As you can see, um, there are 10 of 10 stalls available according to the Electrify America app. So we're going to go on up there, and what I've done is I have added the Tesla Supercharger in Northeast Raleigh, you can see there, as a second stop so that it will precondition the battery because we're at a relatively high state of charge. Got 47% now, we're going to arrive at Electrify America with 40%, so we normally wouldn't pull that much current that fast, but we'll see. Let's go. Okay, we are here at Walmart where the Electrify America station is, and there is now one more car charging, a Chevy Bolt, on the other 350 kilowatt unit. So there's that. I found the other 350 kilowatt unit, number nine, which is open, and uh, the battery didn't precondition the whole way here, but it started preconditioning again when I started driving slow in this parking lot. One thing I wanted to point out before we get started is I don't see anywhere on this packaging where it says the specs of this adapter. Um, no, it's listed as, oh, there it is. Sorry, it's a little label there, and I'm having a hard time reading it, so I hope you can do it. Yep, it says 250 kilowatts max power, which is what all the U.S. ones supposedly say. Anyway... Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, here's our unit, and I was going to plug in first anyway, because that's how you do these CCS things before you get started. I noticed that it said complimentary session, so let's see if that works. I'm going to have to hold the adapter and the camera at the same time. You see I just clicked it in. Now, come over here, press the charge port. And, hmm, seems to not want to go in. Let's see how we're going to do this. Oh, nope. Is it going in? It's blinking blue. I just heard a click. Ah, oh, the screen says initiating charging. Still blinking blue. Oh, blinking green. I think we have liftoff. Or do we? Let's see what the car says. Car says charging. It's ramping up. I don't know if you can see that. 142 kilowatts, which at 40% is pretty darn good. I think I would be down around 100 kilowatt rate on a Tesla supercharger with that state of charge. We are going. Look at that. 25 minutes remaining to get to 80%. Uh, it's backing down now a little bit. 126, 125 kilowatts. Yeah, it's slowly, slowly tapering off. But we've already got it. One kilowatt delivered. Let's see what the screen says. Oh. Yep. This is still a complimentary session. 
but it would have charged us 43 cents a kilowatt if we were uh, not getting it for free. So I did not, I don't have a membership. I just pay as I go on Electrify America. So far, so good. I would have expected to, it to seat further in. Hmm. All right, we're down to 114 kilowatts. So the car is down to 110 kilowatts with four kilowatts hours delivered. All right, we're back to thank you for choosing Electrify America. Just curious as to what rate the charger thinks we are charging at. Still going, the car's still charging. There we go. We've been here two minutes. Um, it would have cost us $1.72 already. We're charging at 108 kilowatts, and we've gotten 6% um, battery. I wonder where it says, oh, energy delivered, 5.8 kilowatts. 108, this says 106. Up in the charger itself just dropped down to 106. So we're going. Still above a hundred, which is which is actually pretty good at this state of charge. It's a little more juice up front than just a straight supercharger, which is a little more conservative. Really cranking. It says we've only been charging three minutes. Already got almost seven kilowatts hours of energy delivered. Keep mixing up those terms. We're charging at a 105 kilowatt speed. We've got seven kilowatt hours delivered. Okay, we just dropped below a hundred kilowatt charging speed after six minutes, starting about 41%, and we've already added 15% to our battery, a little over 12 kilowatt hours delivered. This is really impressive. We have been here charging for 12 minutes. We've got over 20 and a half kilowatt hours and we are still pulling 84, oh, just dropped to 83 kilowatts in charging speed. Added over 27% to my battery. It's not bad. Okay, we've been charging for 18 minutes. We're still pulling 60 kilowatt at 79%. We've gotten up over 28 kilowatt hours delivered. This is pretty good. It's pretty darn good. I wonder if it's going to stop at 80% if the Tesla will make it stop or it'll keep going. Let's see. It stopped at about 80%. Okay, and in the Tesla, it still says 80%. Charging equipment not ready. See equipment instructions to start charging. We're not going to start charging. We're going to stop. Uh, and it says here, here are the stats. We got 29.3 kilowatt hours delivered. It says we stopped at 79%. The Tesla says 80. Took 19 minutes, and it's no charge, apparently. And we've got a 10 minutes grace period. So let's unlock the charge port. Unlock charge port. And let's, gosh, this is a heavy thing. Pull it out. And now I'm going to put the camera down so I can get this um, thing out. Okay, there we go. I was able to pull the adapter right out by just pressing that button on the charge handle. It says, thank you driver. Uh, this session would have cost us $12.47, but there was a $12.47 discount. Uh, so we're good. i click finish here. Weird soft touch buttons. And it says, please plug in. All right, we're done. Let's go home and get dinner.